to give the message from the provincial government of Leti, may I call on the Honorable Governor, Leopoldo Domenico Petilla. His Excellency Benigno S. Aquino III, President of the Republic of the Philippines, Secretary Marrojas and uh, Secretary Ikot Pitilia, uh, FCCCI President Alfonso GC, all uh, members of the Filipino Chinese Chamber of Commerce who are here today, ladies and gen gentlemen, a pleasant good morning to everybody. In three days' time, it would exactly be three months after Super, Yolanda, Super Typhoon Yolanda devastated our province. It is indeed, I would like to note that we are making headways in terms of recovery and rehabilitation. More importantly, for our people, for their families, and, for their, for their, and their livelihood. We are here today to witness the MOA signing between the Filipino Chinese Chamber of Commerce and Industry Foundation Incorporated, province of Leyte for the resettlement site in Palo, Leyte for families who lost their homes during the typhoon. We know for a fact how difficult it is for our families to be displaced, much more to have no means of livelihood to daily sustain our families. But rest assured, the provincial government is addressing this one step at a time. For now, let's get you settled first and your family so you can focus on making a living next. We are thankful that we have the Federation of Filipino Chinese Chamber of Commerce and Industry ready to help us, indeed even before the typhoon came in November, FCCCI is already our partner in building schools and other similarly important projects in Leyte. It is said that it would take more than two years to complete the permanent shelter program for typhoon victims. However, it really pushes the, the process uh, with the local government, the private sector, foreign organizations, the process becomes very fast and further. Every investment or aid brought upon us, it pays back because of the capacity of the community to expand the aid. I continue to call on the private sector, such as the Chamber, the international community, and other private partners to continue its support as the government prepared for reconstruction assistance on Yolanda. A Build Back Better plan for new shelters, ma major infrastructure, education, health, and agri agriculture facilities and systems, among many others in the affected areas. I believe that the people of Plate just don't wait for help. They have really started to organize their, li their lives again and do their best. The United Nations and the national government are currently looking at maintaining food and food aid distribution to the families affect, affected by the typhoon until March. But the focus now shifts to establish more lasting interventions to restore food security. This includes providing seeds and equipment farmers, reopening markets, and ensuring the stability of prices of basic goods in affected areas. We are doing all this to help everybody. And with your cooperation and resilience, I am sure we Litenios can back, get back to where we were even before the typhoon came. Thank you very much. Mabuhay ang Pilipinas. Mabuhay tayong lahat. Thank you, Governor Petilia.